hear me? Yes. Oh, okay. Hi, I'm Eve. Eve, I'm Katie. I'm Katie. Pleasure. Um, are you uh, the coach, a, a student like me? I'm a student like you. <laughs> okay. And who, do you know who our coach is today? I guess we're waiting for our coach. I'm not sure. I'm not sure who it is tonight. Okay. It's my first time doing this. It's fine. Zoom. You'll like it. <laughs> I've only done it a few times. Where are you? Based? Sorry. Where are you based? I'm in Providence, Rhode Island. Oh, okay. I'm in, uh, in Philadelphia. In Philadelphia. Well, this is the fun part for me because I get to use the club a little bit. <laughs> to see what time it is. Uh, it's almost quarter to six. Just quarter to. But we, don't we have a don't we have a coach that is supposed to uh, yes take us yeah. take us through the motion? Yeah, I went to the event calendar and it said um, Tuesday. Got it again. It said Tuesday. Tuesday at five forty-five. Yeah. Right, but the, I thought the date was. A little bit odd when I looked at it. Let's see if I can look at it again. Mm -hmm. 
Chris Campio Campley sent me the calendar today again. Yeah, and it, there is a class, supposedly there's a class at 5.45 p.m. Right, it definitely is. But this is Tuesday the 20th, which is weird because today is the 26th. Mm -hmm. The 29th is um, Friday. There's a, there's a class on, I think they have classes on yoga is on Monday, high intensity is on Tuesday. Oh, I see. I think they're getting on right now. But, okay. Hey, guys. Um, hey. Hi. Hi. How are you? Oh, my gosh. Long time no see. I know. Hello. How are you guys doing? Good. Thank you, Bob. Vicky is, Vicky is there. So you guys need a mat and some light dumbbells. All right, we're going to be doing hit today. We're going to be doing just two circuits, but they're going to be pretty long. So I'll demonstrate um, throughout the first round. And then, you know, obviously, if you have questions, just stop me. Um, unmute yourself. But in the meantime, just make sure you do mute yourself so that anybody watching the recording will just see me instructing. And just tap on your little microphone, make sure it's muted. Or I might be able to mute you guys, let's see. I'll mute you all, gotcha. Mute all. All right, but if you need me, unmute and get my attention. So let's just start with a warm up. Big iron circles. And twist like the side. And reach over head. Long stretches. And bring yourself down to the floor. Sway to the left, down to the right. Squat down. Extend the hips and roll up. Squat down. Extend and roll up. Good. And congrats. Nice and quick. Make sure those knees stay next to each other. Good, and deep chest. So today we're gonna to be incorporating shoulders, chest, legs, obviously cardio. All right, and a couple of kicks. And I want you guys to try not to bend. Just go as high as you can without having to bend. This is going to be that high. One more. Last one. All right. So we're going to start with a six part circuit. The first is going to be shuffles side to side. I should be able to see you in the screen. We're going to get low and we're just going to shuffle high, almost like a skip. And then come down low, sliding with the hips behind you and touch the floor. And then up and down. Up and down. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Good, get nice and high. Perfect. Let's sit back on that heel. Get up there in the middle. Five, four, three, two, last one, and one. All right, from here, we're gonna go into a lunge, reverse lunge with bicep curl and a press. So grab your dumbbells. I'm just gonna open this window. Give me one second. Woo! Little airflow. All right, we're gonna step back. Come down. Hammer curl. That 
means mutual grip, not under the head. I'm sorry, don't bring it down. So come back, step up with the curl, and press. All in a neutral position. Back, curl, press. Very good. Take the time. Make sure you're breathing. Exhale and work your way up. Pressing through those front heels. Good, give me two more reps. And that heel. And knee down. So again, I'm just walking you through this for the first round. Then we'll just keep moving. So third exercise, we're going to be doing shoulder tap, high plank position. Make sure your hands are underneath your shoulders. We're going to alternate tapping your opposite shoulder. If you need to modify, you stay on your knees and do it that way. Three, two, one. There, you can bring your feet apart a little bit if you need to. Try not to sway too much side to side. Keep those hips down. And breathe. Keep going. Three, two, one, gently drop the knees. We're going to come right down into a little plank. I'm going to time it for about 40 seconds or so. Let me get my timer and begin. Keep breathing, we're halfway there. And come down. Very good. Sit back in child's pose. Give your arms a quick stretch. And come on up. Okay. We're going to turn it over. We're staying on the back here for now. And we're going to move into a blue bridge hold with a chest press. You'll need your dumbbells. So we're going to roll down nice and slow using those abs. We're going to lift the hips, pressing through our heels. And we're going to do our chest press and keep those hips up. Okay? Three, two, and one. Make sure you guys breathe out on the way up. Think about core engagement. That means squeezing your glutes, keeping your abs nice and tight, and slow the presses. Breathe, New mass too. Oh, good. <laughs> <laughs> you know, some of them are harder than others. Uh, it's there. Keep those hips up, push those heels down. Five, four, three, two, and hold. You can bring your dumbbells down, but keep those hips up. And we're going to count to 30. I'm going to count my head. Keep those hips up. Good job, Eve. Oh, 
We're firing up the glutes. Halfway there. Five, four, three, two, and slowly lower. Take your time. All right. So now you're going to grab one dumbbell. We're going to move on to a single leg crunch. So your dumbbell is in your right hand. Your left hand is behind your head. I'm sorry, your left hand is out on the floor, probably. Extend your left leg. So we have the dumbbell on our right hand and our left leg is out. We're going to exhale, crunch up towards the ceiling. Leg and dumbbell go towards the ceiling and come back down. We're using a chest press motion. Exhale up, pause, inhale lower. So your other hand can be out for assistance and support, or it should be behind your head to support your neck, whatever is better for you. But just make sure that you're going to out on the way up and in on the way down. Push everything down into the mat. Good. Switch sides. And continue. Really get up there. Get those shoulder blades up off the floor, not just your shoulders. Inhale, stay on. Exhale up. When you get up, you really push that back hip. Push, push, push. Get the shoulder blades on the side of head. One more rep. Good. And you stay down, come up, down. Let's turn over to a high plank. And walk our hands in, coming up off the floor. Take your time rolling out so you don't get dizzy. All right, and we're back to the shuffle. So, I'm not gonna demonstrate everything. You guys know what's going on. If you have questions, let me know. We'll just go right through. So we're starting with the shuffle side to side. Make sure you guys get up high in the center. Three, two, one. And sit back. Up and down. Get up nice and high. Good, way to push off the heels. Keep going. Get up. Five, four, three, two, one more, and one. All right, moving on to the reverse lunge. Catch your breath, deep breath in, deep breath out. And begin. Make sure that when you curl, your elbows don't move. Just the forearms. Two more to go. All the way down, finish that last rep. High five, shoulder taps. Let me get my timer, we're gonna go for 40 seconds and then a 40 second low five in three, two, one. 
Here we go. 
two. Equals ready. Three, two, one. Up and down. Get up nice and high. Now we're practicing lateral movement. Use the side of the leg. Keep it up. Five, four, three, two, last one. All right, take it out. Catch your breath, grab your dumbbells. Right to the reverse lunges. Elbows stay put. more together. Make sure you guys have a neutral grip here. Keep it going. So guys, neutral grip means this way, not overhand, okay? It's a neutral grip. Last two. Neutral, neutral. Last one. Neutral, neutral. All right, good job. Down and back. Shoulder plank, over tops. We grab my timer. Five, four, three. Oh, go ahead, you take your time. There we go. Two and one. You guys keep going. I'm repeating the modified version for anybody watching. Later on, we're going to drop the knees. We're on a nice angle and we're going to continue the shoulder taps. Ten seconds. Strong core, strong core. Take your time. Eyes come down. We make sure you have nice tight abs throughout and nice control. Low plank in five, four, three, two, one. Keep breathing. Squeeze those abs, squeeze those abs. Ten seconds, keep squeezing. Three, two, one. Pile toes, full extension. All right, let's turn around. Blue bridge, chest press, roll down nice and slow. And begin. Take your time for bringing the dumbbells back down. That's where you want to go nice and slow in this movement. You can use your power to push, and then you want to use your strength to resist the weights from coming right back down. And keep those hips up, don't forget about them.
So make sure you guys are doing a press, not a fly. Elbows are coming straight down and over overhand grip. And you're punching right up to the ceiling. And you can keep the hips up, drop the thumbnails carefully. Keep those hips up nice and high. Hold, 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 breathe. Come down nice and slow. All right, punch it. Last time. Then we're going to move on. Three, two, one. Breathe out. Breathe in. Slow it right up. That smells like steak and potatoes. It smells so good. And put your hands 
next to your armpits here. We're going to push up to a high plank. You guys are going to do inchworms. So we're going to walk our hands in. Roll up nice and slow. And do a calf raise on the big toes. Don't pull out onto your pinky toes. Walk your hands back out. Once you reach that perfect plank, hands on the shoulders, walk in. Roll up nice and slow. Calf raise. Roll up, this one, and get yeah, All right. Up next, we have grab your dumbbells. We're going to do a lateral raise, which means side. Elbows are slightly bent. You never lock those elbows out. They're very soft. So there's just the slightest, slightest bend, not that. Okay? And then we're going to do an underhand raise. So we go lateral. And then underhand grip to the front. So again, you want to keep that little soft scoop the whole time. You don't want to do this or this. Now you're doing biceps. You want to keep it chest and shoulders. All right, three, two, your shoulder height. Exhale. And inhale, lower. Exhale. Inhale, lower. Not a bicep curl. Let me show you from the side. Not a bicep curl. Extended elbows are just soft. Perfect. Perfect. Chest is tall. Chin is up. And you're exhaling to lift. You have to use those abs. Just shoulder height, even not too high. Last time, up, and up, and down. Great job. Before you put your dumbbells down, let me just see if you have one more. Oh, okay, we're doing a punch thing. So, dumbbells are here. We're punching down, okay? So we're gonna pick up the pace a little bit. In three, two, one, punch. Punch. You want to be in control. Don't lock out the elbow. Abs are tight. We're twisting in the oblique. You can feel that right here. Five. Four, three, two, last one. One. Good. Burpees. One goes down. So we have the burpee. What was next? The, the walkout. Something before that. Oh, Superman. Burpee, Superman, inchworm, lateral, and underhand raise, punch pounds. Here we go. Three, two, one.
hands next to you. Come on up to a plank. Begin your inch work. Real nice and slow. Control the calf raise. Come back down.
three, two, one. Back, your head around. All right, 